For hundreds of years, people imagined that the world was flat. Its true shape only came to light through the use of technological means. Our planet is round, but not completely spherical, however. Its shape is that of an ellipse, slightly flattened at the poles and slightly bulging at the equator. This unique shape of the Earth is described as geoid and was only discovered in the last few hundred years. Yet this special shape of the Earth is clearly set out in the Quran. The verse in question reads, After that, he smoothed out the earth. In the above verse, the word Daha is used in the original Arabic. The choice of this word to describe the earth is particularly striking because Daha stems from the Arabic word Dahu which word is used to describe the action of adjusting or smoothing something out in a spherical manner. For example, words derived from that root are also used for the place where an ostrich lays its eggs and the egg itself. Indeed, our earth bears a very close resemblance to a geoid-shaped ostrich egg. The use of the word Daha contains important information about the shape that God has given to the earth. There is no doubt that the way attention is drawn to these facts in the Quran, at a time when people's knowledge concerning the universe was very limited, is a manifest proof that it is the word of God.